Well, it doesn't look like we have any comments saying, Hey, Fucat, we want to see more Outlast. But five likes and a cat enjoying the series sounds good enough to me. Here we go! Welcome to the House of Kittens, everyone. This is Fucat, and today is episode two of Outlast. We're heading down to the basement, and I completely forgot that I need to get batteries, so I'm going to be doing that after I clear this place out. I don't really need the documents. But we're going to be zooming through this, hopefully not getting killed by that Batman. <laughs> Batman. <laughs> um, okay. Push the button. Hide in the lockers. And of course, if you already know, the dude's going to be checking next to the lockers next to me. They, like they always do. Talk about reality here. <laughs> By the way, I did a little bit of research on the turns that I was trying to find. You know, like, like that bald guy from X-Men. His name is Professor X. I desperately want to call him Professor Bald, but it's Professor X. And Pinchilla. Apparently that's an Argentina word meaning penis or dick. And there's a lot of Pinchillas in this game, so watch out for that. You don't want a pinchilla up me. Okay, is that dude holding a lantern? Oh, no, no, he's holding a bat. At first it looked like he was holding a lantern. I was like, dude, you're not in amnesia. Okay, dude, are you gonna leave? Because I'm ready to press the other button and escape from this place. Dude, why are you just standing there? Oh my god, are you kidding me? Is this game bugged? Because this, uh, Steam just updated, so I'm assuming they just bugged Outlast. So now he's just standing there. What the fuck? Dude, he, if he doesn't leave in like one or two minutes, I'm gonna get out. This is annoying as hell. Oh my god, dude! Just go! Fuck this. I'm out. Dude, he didn't even see me. What the fuck? This game is so stupid. I swear to God. I waited there for like one or two minutes. He didn't even leave, and he didn't even see me when I left. He was just like, huh. I just heard the locker open. Don't know who did it. And I know these guys have really good night vision. So I don't know how they don't fucking see me. Let me film you a little bit more, buddy. <gasps> no! Oh, you need to wear shoes. I don't want to see that fucking feet older. Athlete's foot, motherfucker. So, I'm assuming it's safe to leave now? Let me wait 10 seconds just in case. Alright, I waited 10 seconds. Let's leave. Oh shit. <laughs> Hide under the bed. <laughs> so, it doesn't even matter how long you wait, he's still gonna see you. <laughs> you know, he's really strong for a person who doesn't have feet. Like, no shoes on. Oh no, his feet are... Oh no, it's not. I thought it was bleeding at first. Okay, he went that way, so I'm safe to go that way. The other way is the way I need to go anyway. And my battery's about to die. Later! <laughs> Alright, get it. Well, that was easy. Get the battery, get into the locker, and wait it off. Tch. Tch. 
Was that a fly? Because I just killed the fly today. He shouldn't be here. I can't see him. Oh, he looked at the locker next to me, like I said. So unreality. So I wonder what happens if you play insane. Will they know what locker you're in, no matter if you hide it in, in there or not? Alright, how do you switch out batteries? Okay, there we go. And we're off! We're off to see the wizard, the wonder what was of Oz. I just sing that like a stupid motherfucking shit. <laughs> Oh, I'm doomed. Oh, I'm turning this on. I think... God damn this fucking... <laughs> I think the battery mouse is about to die. What the fuck? I wasn't even serious about that. Alright, I gotta get some batteries up here. Before I can do anything else. Well, that was pretty easy. I don't know why that took so many people a long time to beat. Okay, yeah, there's a fly. Oh my god. No matter what, how many like flies I kill, they're gonna come back. I'm fucking cursed. Okay. We just got a fucking orgasm here, no batteries. There's gotta be a battery, I swear. There's a battery somewhere. Alright, fine then. Just orgasm. Oh yeah, that's right. <laughs> I was about to close the door and then I just remembered the walker messed it up. Uh, uh. I'm sorry, my son. I didn't want to have to do this to you. Mm -hmm. But you can't leave. Not yet. There's so much yet for you to witness. And he's supposed to be a good guy, and he did this? Can you? Our Lord, the Wall Rider, tearing his truth into the unbelievers. The only way out of this place is the truth. Accept the gospel, and all doors... Accept the truth. Not what I remember in the DLC. Fucking Professor X. You know what? I'm gonna change the name here. His name is Professor Bald now. Screw that. And... Huh. When should I end the game here? Should I end the gameplay here? Well, it's about to be time for this gameplay, so maybe I'm going to be ending it here. And I should be spawned it here once I start back, because when I started back for this episode, I started back where I had to hide in the locker from Walker. So I'll just stop here. Um, let me go up here first and let that door dude open the door. Um, yeah. No use for that. You know what, I'm gonna be playing more just for fun. <gasps> oh my god! Kevin Bacon knows, man! Yep, these dudes have chillers. You don't want to look at them. Those chillers are nasty. Okay, I guess since my camera's gonna be shutting off a lot, I'm gonna be ending it here. Dude, I seriously want to punch that guy just for like bashing his head to the wall. But that's gonna be the end of gameplay. Hope you guys enjoyed. Um, didn't seem that much. I hope that was enough for you guys to enjoy. Subscribe in the outro if you have not. Share this to your friends on Facebook and Twitter. And as always, stay awesome kittens, stay awesome cats, stay awesome creepy cat army. I will see you then. Here we go. Oh no, it's the puddle of disabilities.